As President Obama and GOP leaders reel ever closer to the perilous fiscal cliff, one longtime GOP deficit hawk is dancing? Ex-Wyoming Senator Alan Simpson's aiming to grab eyeballs Gangnam style, using the Korean dance craze to enlist young voters in demanding Washington not kick the debt can down the road. Boy, these old coots will clean out the treasury before you get there. With talks on averting the year-end cliff of big tax hikes and spending cuts seemingly deadlocked, Republicans say the next 72 hours are critical. We put an offer on the table. The president now has to engage. And if the president doesn't agree uh, with uh, our proposal and our outline, I think he's got an obligation uh, to send one to the Congress. But Obama, having already rejected the GOP's deeper spending cuts, told the business group the next move is theirs. He says Republicans must accept higher tax rates on the rich. We can probably solve this in about a week. It's not that tough. But we need that conceptual breakthrough. Yet he also had a warning. Don't pick another fight over the debt ceiling in hopes of greater leverage. So I want to send a a very clear message to people here. Uh, We are not going to play that game next year. The nation's credit rating took a beating when a debt ceiling fight two summers ago nearly led to default. Meantime, a Pew Research Center poll suggests if government does plunge over the fiscal cliff, Americans would blame Republicans by a two-to-one margin reinforcing the view of Team Obama that time is not on the GOP's side. Mark Smith, The Associated Press, The White House.